this industry, you actually have to have practical experience Absolutely. to do this. Absolutely. It's how to yeah. make, like you it's said how before. To make, you how know? to make it. When you came to us to to look for mannequins, you didn't just want the size medium, which I was very glad that you mm. wanted the entire size range and you wanted the plus right. sizes right. and you wanted the men. I was very impressed because you have different forms for different markets, which you don't see. So uh, you don't see often, you just don't see it. So, so we knew what we wanted. And then when I saw the ASTM, that was my icing on the cake because I figured yeah. this is something that's approved, it's industry tested, and I felt that was like the label that I was looking for. Mm -hmm. So we are getting some of those coming in in the fall. Mm -hmm. So um, we, we were very, very happy with the product the way we got it. A lot of the time we think about design and we just think about fashion catwalks and all that. Well see, this is this is the idea behind the course, to stimulate them to think be outside of the norm. Could you describe the course to me a little bit, like from, from uh, the technical design course? How long is it? How you know. It's a Bachelor of Science course. Uh, it's two years. Mm -hmm. uh, we have uh, advanced textiles, advanced manufacturing. Um, we have a production pattern making, beginning pattern making. Uh, we have computerized pattern making and marking and grading. And then we have the technical design wovens and knits. And then we top it off with uh, the capstone project. What is the capstone project? Very exciting. I will let her say it because she's the head of the capstone. We have one other course that's integrated into what she just mentioned and that is the fit correction, fit and pattern correction oh, because that's another thing that a lot of people don't stress which is that fitting. So they address fitting in the tech design class and they also have a specialized course in just for fit and fit correction. So they have to go back to the pattern and suggest the corrections. The capstone course is putting the entire coursework together, the whole body of work together. They're coming up with a new product or an improved product. Okay. So we have students that come up because they have design background. Right. So now they're bringing all of their talent together. We divide them up into teams and they they take a, a particular area. For example, it could be uh, camping, it could be rainwear, it could be, it's not a fashion show. We don't want it to be a fashion show. So they'll come up and they'll, reinvent reality, so to speak. They have to develop the entire prototype, they have to do the tech pack, and they also have to do the research behind it and say why this is necessary. We have a group, a team right now working with the veterans, and they're working with amputees, they're working with Parkinson's, and so, so that team is divided into three different categories, Parkinson's, amputees, and wheelchair bound. So they're, they're in the hospital, they're working with the, with the you know, with the vets, and they're all excited. It's not an easy thing. I mean, yeah. we, we run a tight ship. And I think that that helps a lot because young people sometimes need a little bit of discipline in order to mm -hmm. kind, of, kind of ease them into the work uh, environment. I came to FIT as a student, and, uh, and then I went out to industry and I worked for, um, I started really working for the uh, commercial pattern companies and I did writing for them. I did the instructions on the instruction sheet and put the whole garment together. And I worked with the illustrators and I worked with the pattern makers and so um, that's how I started to work. When a parent hears that they want their child wants to go into fashion, usually they're not very no. supportive. My parents were not supportive. <laughs> <laughs> they said, no, you're not going to make it. How could you do that? Da, da, da. So then, of course, I had to prove them that I could, so I did. But um, it is it's very tough. It's very, very tough in every single area and everything. Uh, the great thing about tech design, that's the last place that they're going to start getting rid of people. Exactly. Because the fit of the garment is the most important thing in the whole entire process of mm -hmm. fashion design. I mean, it's the reason why people will go back to a brand and it's because you find a pair of trousers that you really like you'll go back to that brand because you think that it fits you and, exactly and of course there's a whole process that goes into that yeah. it doesn't matter how great a fashion designer you are how great uh, production you have how great salespeople you have um, it doesn't matter anything because if the garment doesn't fit at the end of the day then you lose everybody Alvinon's very proud to be part of you know your program and to have to have you know, sponsored some of the, the tools that you actually have to use. Um, we, 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 we want to be able to give back and there is only a, there's only a certain way that we can. And as much as we can give back to, to this industry, it's really through people like you who are teaching.